Hi guys, welcome to this video looking at what a fuel cell is. If we start off with the chemical equation for what happens in a fuel cell then, nice and simply, hydrogen, H2, reacts with oxygen, O2, to form water, H2O. Now when this happens, it releases energy, and it's that energy that is useful in a fuel cell. Now there are two steps to this which you need to know if you do in the higher paper. The first is your hydrogen, H2, which we get from our fossil fuels, is oxidised, so it loses electrons and turns into hydrogen ions, which are H plus ions, and it leaves you with four electrons spare. These hydrogen ions are then introduced to oxygen, which we get from our air, and a chemical reaction occurs between the hydrogen ions and the oxygen. This is where reduction occurs, and the hydrogen gains back its electrons forming water in the process. And that's it, that's what a fuel cell is. So let's have a look at some questions the examiners can ask you. I've got three for you to have a go at, so pause the video, have a go, and we'll see how you've done in a minute. Okay, let's go through. So question one, the word equation, hopefully you remember, is hydrogen reacting with oxygen. That gets you your first mark, and then it forms water, which is your second mark. Question two, writing the balanced equation. Again, hopefully you remember from what you've seen that hydrogen goes around in pairs, so it's H2, and so does oxygen, so it's O2. Putting those two in for your reactants gets you your first mark. Then, what do they form? Water, which hopefully we all know is H2O. That's going to get you your second mark. And then finally, your third mark is for the balancing, so we have only one oxygen on the right and two on the left, so I'm going to double my water, therefore giving me four hydrogens on the right, so all I have to do is put a two in front of my H2 on the left, giving me my balanced equation for three marks. And then on to question three, so we've got two stages of which you can get two marks from each, so if we start off with stage one, you can say that hydrogen loses electrons or is oxidised for one mark. You can also say that the hydrogen forms hydrogen ions, for the second mark, or you can put the ionic equation. So 2H2 goes to 4H plus plus 4E minus. Any two of those three points will get you two marks for stage one. For stage two, the next thing you say is that the hydrogen ions then gain electrons or are reduced for a mark. You can then say they react together with oxygen to form water for the second mark. And again, you can put the ionic equation, which is 4H plus plus 4E minus plus O2 goes to 2H2O. So how did you get on? Hopefully you've done well, and I have got a review question for you. So have a go at it, and let me know what you think in the comments. Hi guys, hopefully you found the video useful. If you did, please click on like, and please subscribe to my channel. If you've already done that, Please share with your friends, share with your teachers, any way that's going to help me. I've also got a website with loads of videos that can help you, and there's also my latest video appearing on the screen now. Thanks for watching.